This is it, boys and girls. The real finale of the whole entire game. Because uh, we're going to beat it. So, uh, anyways. You should turn those corners up, or your happiness will spill right out. Come on, smile. Transient though their presence here was, it is curious you managed to defeat them. Sorry, we couldn't stop him. Don't worry, we will! Yeah! Careful, he can transform. Oh baby, here we are, Brandalus! I'm gonna kick you in the butt for everything you've done, but first off, uh, this is not the right stack to do that, so I, I was gonna use Libra, but of course that's the long stack that can't do that. Uh, it's rain stack that has the ability that I'm looking for. That's right, Libra. We haven't really healed up okay. since the last battle. So, so a little bit of a handicap right there. I don't know the HP and don't know the... Don't really have any method on... Whoa. Not what I'm looking for. Ah, here we go. I guess he's susceptible to slow if you were going to do anything. Uh, but that that's about all you get in terms of weaknesses. And that, I guess, just well on him or something. No. Well, that was super flashy, but here's a question. 
are all those weapons a reference to the previous Final Fantasy game? Because they look a little unfamiliar to me. Just saying. Just gonna use a little cure, then I'm gonna... Let's see, what can I do? I could probably do that. I might as well just go all out. You're not really worth my time, Abyss. <laughs> Darkness doesn't really affect lawn stacks, so it's all good either way. I know, this this should be a little more, a little more, I don't know, flashy and a little more pizzazz, but I'm just not really feeling it, you know? Brandalus can transform. Is, 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 is he transformed? I mean, I feel like there's something to it, though, but God help me, it just doesn't have the essence of real final battle here. He's using different numbers. Let's see, we had, what, the bell, katana, what was the other one, the harp? Do we have the harp again? Yeah, there's the bell. So, he, oh, it was the harp. Uh, so question, these guys clearly aren't Brandalus, but are they supposed to be other X-9 Knights that didn't have a body to, like, trans- like transfer their souls into like something just just curious the mind's wandering here because uh, this whole battle's interesting let's see you're fine because you got you got some kills every time you attack that was kind of flashy let's see I might as well use a little Kuraga because uh, could use a little bit of health there we go everything's looking a bit more green oh he's 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 already getting pretty weak here we go. Let's get some more X9 Knights. Oh, that's the Katana. We got a Katana broadsword and a spear. Or a lance. So, I, I take it, depending on the weapons that are used, it determines the amount of damage. That that's what I'm assuming here, because why wouldn't it be? Those look very fancy. It looks like... Oh, God. Why is it yellow? <laughs> is this going to do a lot of damage or... Are we going to be brought down to 1 HP? Oh. I'm starting to realize. Depending on what he uses, it determines a certain elemental... A, a certain elemental effect. Maybe the weapons have some sort of element associated with them. Like the sword is holy or something like that. That would explain... Ooh, he's got the double cut. That's a fancy weapon. And he put darkness on us. See if I was a smart man, and I'm not. I'll use cure. Not what I need to use that on. Oh, he's going to use more sacraments. What we get? I I don't know. The staff, axe, and the the bow. I am not really convinced this is going to do as much damage as I thought it was going to be. It looks like dark elemental too, and it healed him. I, I'm. I'm thinking we got this in the bag. It's not really anything to worry about. He's looking pretty weak. I'm not even gonna, like, restack my guys, because it's over. Yeah, that was simple. All right! <sighs> we won? No. Yeah. Not yet. Fool. I have hunted the worlds of A for ages, but yours was the very first in which I made true progress. Which means I can now bring my rules into your world, and I happen to be exceedingly fond of my rules. Observe! <laughs> Not even the champions of this A-world can vanquish me. So, your choice. Will you bow before my rules? Or will I watch you snap as the rules of my world break you? Uh, oh, man. Suppressing the... F I can't use my champion medals. I can use my mega medals. I can't use my champion medals. Just to prove a point, it's grayed out. 
I know you guys be, would be saying, oh, come on, man. No, can't use them. That's the force. Uh, all that said, that's unfortunate. I was thinking, man, it would be pretty sweet. Okay, so this battle in a nutshell. This guy is a dick. I should probably get a little bit of lever action. Might as well see what we're up against so you guys know. It's only the final boss. Oh god, he's got he's got question mark HP, unimprisable, obviously. Let's see what we got. Oh, he's not susceptible to anything, not even slow like his original form. He's transformed. Uh, little detail. He's got a dragon head, very representative of the Bahamut. That'll be more apparent as we go through this battle. Anyways, uh, aside from that, I'm just gonna shut up and start welling on him. No point drawing this out more than necessary. He's gonna do the same thing. So this battle, if I had to recollect to any of the other final battles in a Final Fantasy game, oh, this is a chaotic impulse. Definitely representative of Bahamut, but if I remember correctly, this thing hurts a lot more than just damage. I think it does statuses. And if I'm not mistaken, that's very rep No, it didn't do any status. Okay, we're fine. He, do he has an attack that does a lot of statuses. Reminds me of the final boss in Final Fantasy IX. Grand Cross, if I'm not mistaken. Very, very, very annoying attack. Because there's so many statuses. And oh, he's got a level 4 fire. Fire spell. That hurts a lot. It's fine. I'm not even gonna be worried about using some of my potions and high-valued items like I got an elixir right here. I'm gonna use it. That was a bad dark rebel. Ah, there it is! Knew it was gonna happen at some point. Poison. Confusion. Obliviousness. I've got this. Not a good spell to get hit with. Just, just saying. Let's see. If I was gonna, if I was gonna pick myself up from this remedy, sounds like a pretty good item. There we go. That's look pretty legit. It's got level four spells, and they hit like a truck. Let's see. If I was gonna. What do you have that I can really make use of? Misdirect? No, that's not good. Uh, might as well just use Dark Mystery for the time being. Oh yeah, here we go. It's going, it's going to hit hard. I can feel it. It's going to be beautiful. Not as good as I wished. I'm fine with it though. Any damage helps. Ooh, baby. Here we go. Missed. I'm fine with that. Oh, he's got. He's fast. He's fast. Uh, let's see. I don't think you can. No, you can't. Then there's only one thing to do about this Mega Elixir. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. And I, I guess I'll just keep on attacking. We hit pretty hard. He hits pretty hard. Oh, he's got a level, level four error spell. Arrow spell. Not too bad. Are we gonna see all the level four spells? That would be pretty legit. I'm fine with it. It's fancy. I wish I had that capability. Oof. Not a huge fan of that spell, that ability. Anyways, so as you can kind of tell, the final battle, I, I think we've really seen all that there is to see here. I mean, I guess for the most part, it's just kill yourself from all these statuses and then, oh, there we go. There was one last thing I failed to mention. He has... A big, dirty ability. 
I don't want to spoil it too much because we're about to see it. But for the time being, I'm attack. I'm attack, and then... Let's see, who should I bring out? Ah, let's get Bacon out! This is gonna save me a lot of heartache. Just gonna say it right here now. Bacon can tank a lot of damage. I mean, Gillum would also be a pretty legit strategy if I had to say so, because he can straight up negate damage, but Bacon's a good choice. I gotta summon him somewhere along these lines. I mean, gotta put all my mirages that have the, the awesomeness to the test. They're all good choices. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's gonna try to use his super move. Going down to two. Well, you know what? Oh, let's see. Uh, I'm not gonna use Revenge Blast. It's coming, though. Oh, it's it's coming. I will, I will just attack, because, no, I hit like a truck. Here we go, Mega Flare Cannon. Oof. Mega Flare Cannon, everybody. Hits hard, but not as hard as I thought it was going to hit. Oh, he's using Quake, too. He's not as tough as I... Well, maybe it's just because I have a Mega Mirage. Chaos Pulse? Oh. Oh, yeah. We have Counter. It's, a, it's good. It's a good. It's a good strat. I like it. Dark Re Oh god. He's also He's I guess my guy's also susceptible. But that's fine. I'll use a revenge blast. It'll be good. Oh, we're we're doing it. I hope that uh obliviousness doesn't interfere with that. 3 2 Oh, maybe, okay. I can't do... That <sighs> sucks. Because it would have been a good... Yeah, I can't do it. Damn it. I guess I'll just attack him. That's all I can really do. At least I can tank the, uh... Take the Mega Flare Cannon. It's fine. I'm fine with that. If I had Revenge Blast, this guy would be taking a large amount of damage and it would be super legit. It'd be amazing. I can't use items though, that sucks. Hmm. Oh man. Oh, thank God. I think, because I feel bad for bacon, things are looking pretty grim. I'm not what I was gonna do. No. All right, I think I'll release him. Save my AP. Give it to Gildum eventually. There we go. All right, let's see. Uh, oh, that's no good. I think for the time being, because I gotta figure out the best way to go about this. I think I will use. Uh, I'm I'm debating between using an elixir or if I should use Kuraga, because both are pretty good. I think I'll use an elixir. Use that lawn stack. There we go. And then you, I don't know. Just use cure. There we go. That, that's good. That's pretty good. Oh, he's using the Chaos Pulse. 
this. Eh. Bait encounter. That was it? <laughs> I, I thought it was going to be more drawn out. No. Is it done yet? Almost. Just a little more time. Really? Is that all? Concentrate. Focus on the cage so it only encases him. Right. Folly. Come on. We're not going to make it. Lady Luce. Cage within a cage. Focus. Imagine nesting many cages together. Dad. Rain, you need to be the strong one. Don't let Lon's power overtake him. Keep control. Mom? You'll be okay. If you work together, there's no happiness you can't attain. Rain, you ready? Yeah. Such power is not possible. Rain, we did it. Yeah.
There! Use those to keep Grimoire safe. You'll find all the other prismariums with Seraphie. Huh? What? What are you saying? The Dyad has done enough damage. It's time for us to leave for good. <sighs> you can't. I don't. Everything's going to be better, Wynn. Once we go through, the portal will vanish. So these trash cans won't ever be able to meddle in your world again. But what about you? Hey, get those corners turned up. You don't want your happiness spilling out. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Tama! Take care of Wynn and Grimoire for us once we're gone. And thank you for everything. <sighs> Here goes! Uh. Owen, win! All of you! Sorry we put you through so much grief! Goodbye! Goodbye! Take care! We'll see you around! They brought us so much bad and good, and then they just swept it all away in the end. I'll say, the two of them were a force of nature. Maybe I'll take a leaf out of their playbook, and go a little crazy for a change! Oh please, your current crazy levels are hard enough on us. Well, at least Rain and Lon seem like they're gonna be okay. Yes, if they stay together, we have nothing to worry about. <laughs> okay. It's our turn. Grimoire's gonna need some fixing up. It's gonna be a lot of work. Well, see ya. Thanks, you two. You can rest now. Well done. Well, damn. Uh, we did it, everybody. We get this fancy full dance party. Yeah, I, I know, I could just let it play, but I, I gotta, I gotta attack during the credit sequence, cause I mean, why not? We did it, everyone! Uh, and we, we get a fun little, little cast going on here. Yeah, every, everyone like that? I, I think it's cute. I think it's very adorable. Kinda like it, the music's very upbeat. Had to have a happy end, everybody. I know, a lot of raid, they're gone. They went to some sort of alternate planet. Are we ever, or I don't know, they're somewhere in the universe. Will we ever see them again? Um, I leave that up for debate. They're right there. So uh, there you go, you know, they're, they're fine. See, they're dancing, they're with Anna Crow. Everything is fine. <laughs> my my real question here would be: Okay, say they're they're out in the universe, right? How are they going to eat? I mean, shelter and uh, other necessities aside, like I don't know, going to the bathroom and stuff. Uh, that's one thing, but 
You know, you need sustenance in order to live. And going to, like, another planet or being somewhere lost in the universe... Uh, by the way, out in space, how are they gonna breathe? I, I know it's a fantasy world, but I mean, th there's some of those things that are kind of a necessity. A little bit of logic dictates that that's gotta... Uh, uh, I'm not ready to see Cloud dancing like that. I mean, sure, it's, uh, quiet Cloud... Oh, God, Squall, why? That's totally against your character. I mean, Terra, I can, I can kind of see it with Terra. I can see it with Titus, too. I mean, that, that, it's in character. I, I don't know about the Warrior of Light. Sorry, I'm just so distracted by everything going on here. But, you know, all that aside, uh, I hope you like World of Final Fantasy. I had a lot of fun playing it. I think it's fun. I think it's a great game. Everybody should kind of... Everybody should try it at least once. I have a feeling they're never going to go back to it, though. <clears throat> no, that kind of sucks. But it is what it is. There's a lot of questions. I, I tell you what, if they ever do make a, a sequel, or at the very least, some sort of continuation in this whole entire universe, the fi World of Final Fantasy universe, I I'd like to see what they can do. Because I feel like Brandalus isn't dead. I feel like they could do a lot more with the X9 Knights. That would be pretty legit. I, I feel like there could be another planet. May I mean, Anna Crow seems like this was just one of her worlds that were taking over. I feel like she could create another world. And the X9 Knights find that one and they're going to try to take over. Gotta go fight the Cogna again. Can't surround the universe. I'd be fine with that. I'd like to see a lot more mirages. Oh boy, big dance number! <laughs> uh, still, still not used to seeing Cloud and Squall busting a move like this. Kind of goes against the character a little bit, but you know I, I, what can I say? Anna Crow is probably the one responsible, so can't go against it. Uh, I, I have to say, I wish there was more Final Fantasy characters. God, I, I like the Final Fantasy characters. We even had some non-Final Fantasy characters make a show up. Like Sora. That was pretty legit. I, I'd like to see more of the uh, more of the franchises that are related to related to the Final Fantasy esque style. You know, let's get some world let's get some the world ends with you. That'd be pretty cool. Let's get some uh, Parasite Eve going. I'd be fine with that. Uh, let's see. I uh, could use more Final Fantasy 12 going on. I mean, I know... I know we got Balthier. He's a DLC champion medal that you can download, but I, let's, let's get, like, Vaughn and Pinello. That'd be pretty legit. I'd be okay with that. Let's get some Final Fantasy 2 going on. Where's the Final Fantasy 2? You know? Where's all the villains? Heck, let's just get Cypher up in this bitch. I like Cypher. Cypher's pretty legit, not gonna lie. Ferris, Ferris was pretty alright. Let's get more Final Fantasy V going up here. Uh, actually, no, they did a pretty good job with Final Fantasy. I think Bart's and uh, Ferris are a pretty good choice. Then again, I don't really know a whole lot about Final Fantasy V. I still need to get to that. One day, I, I might actually start going into the Final Fantasy like series. I might. I'm thinking about it. Start with Final Fantasy 1, work my way up as things progress. Riku was a pretty good choice, not gonna lie. They did, they did get a pretty good choice of characters, if I do say so myself. But, uh, could still use a little bit of Final Fantasy 2 going on here. Uh, you can leave out the Final Fantasy 13 cast characters. Okay, alright, you gotta include them. And, of course, Final Fantasy 15 wasn't exactly released yet. Or, it, it was pretty new. It's pretty new. It came out. It was a pretty good game. Let's get some DLC Final Fantasy 15 going on. <laughs> That'd be pretty alright. And Gilgamesh. Gotta have Gilgamesh. So I, I can keep talking about Final Fantasy all day long because there's a lot to go on. I, I like Final Fantasy. It's, it's a great series. This is just kind of a nice little love letter to all us fans. I do have to say though, man... Where do I go from here? Well, uh, 
I have to say, World of Final Fantasy isn't done yet. It's been like over a year. Started this back in like 2016. It's 2018 currently. I'm dating this just a little bit. Uh, but yeah, we have another thing we got to do with World of Final Fantasy. It's not over yet. There is a bonus dungeon that we can do. So we'll be we'll be experiencing that. Oh, it's Sid. Which Sid is it? We'll never know. Actually, I think they put him in a tin can just to be like, it could be all the Sid's. Although I think technically it only is limited to a couple, but you know, you fill you fill in which said you want it to be. We also have the twins room, which I haven't really gone into. Um, I'll probably show that off in the next part, along with the bonus dungeon, getting into that, and then we'll cover the bonus dungeon. I got a couple more Colosseum battles that I'd like to do. I got a couple more levels that I gotta get to. Uh, there's like another feature that we've unlocked now that we beat the game. Gotta go do that. All fans of Final Fantasy, that includes me. Ah, uh, well, thank you, Square Enix, for making this game. I know it's going to be forgotten, but hey, it is what it is. Oh, I nearly forgot. You both have a reward coming. Don't you hate when you say all your goodbyes and then find out you're not leaving? It's the worst. Aw, uh, let's just roll with it. One thing about Grimoire, it never gets old for me. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. Lon and Ray, they're not actually lost in the universe. They're they're back. They're back. Anna Crow's like, oh, I guess I can't have you wandering around in space, starving to death, or uh I don't know, not being able to breathe. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save. I'm gonna end this here. It's a pretty good time to end it. So next time, bonus stuff, and then I think we're done. So yeah, I'll see you there.